Today, we'll be revealing new details about the upcoming tanky meetup. We'll also be reminding you about how to deal with the impending Chrome issues and announcing the new TOF tournament. Hello, tankers! Tank coins will be released in the next couple of weeks. As we've already explained, this new currency can be only bought and spent in the shop. Once the first launch phase is over, you'll also be able to get a small number of tank coins from the new weekly containers. And eventually, most likely from September, you'll also be getting them as rewards in the free tier in monthly challenges. Now a bit of a reality check. Some players seem to have gotten the idea that they will be earning a ton of tank coins by playing and then buy the entire shop. Unfortunately, things will not be so rosy. Earning 10 coins through gameplay will be possible, but it will take quite a bit of effort to collect enough to make a purchase, and you won't be able to do it often. Now let's talk about our tanky meetup. This will be no ordinary meetup. It'll be a road trip. And we'll be visiting four locations. It's gonna be quite an adventure. We'll be releasing more information in the coming weeks, so keep your eyes on the news. In case you haven't heard, the current challenge has been extended by two days to make up for the fact that we had to start it later than usual. This means you have a couple of extra days to finish your challenge and snatch the awesome Railgun Prime skin. The same extension applies for the War for Space, where you'll be in the chance to win a Nokia 5.1 Plus smartphone. Check out the challenge page to find out how you can join the draw. The link is in the description. On a final note, remember that the Turbo Bundle will disappear from the shop for 24 hours, starting from the server restart on July 31st. The bundle includes stars and premium, but you have to decide where you need them the most, whether in the July challenge or in August. And don't forget the hot, exclusive animated paint Turbo. By the way, if you're curious about what's coming in the August challenge, here's a sneak peek. Next week, Google Chrome will be updated. For those of you who are currently playing on this browser, we recommend you start exploring other options for playing tanky, because Chrome is about to make your life pretty hard. You can use another browser, or you can use the existing Flash client. And then there's the HTML5 version of the game, but you'll need a decent graphics card for that. You can find the link in the description. As one famous wizard once said, Chrome users, Fly, you fools! Esports news. TOF tournaments continue. Are you a Hammer Pro? Do you think you're the best? Prove it. Registrations for TOF Solo Hammer are open, and we're waiting for you. Prizes include crystals, containers, premium, your choice of XT or Prime skins, and most importantly, the coveted Acid Paint and the Spectrum module, with protection against all turrets and mines. The link to the registration page is in the description. Now, here's our weekly YouTube digest of tanky videos worth watching. Let's start with Mr. Thunder, who managed to get a first place in battle without moving. Or at least that's what he claims. What do you think? Fair? Unfair? True? Lie? Tell us! Next, Surprises takes the Simoom kit out for a spin. Have a look. And finally, watch AFF on the road to legend using Gauss exclusively. That's all for today, tankers! This one was short and sweet, but at least you have more time to earn stars. Go trash some enemies! Bye! In the last episode, Shaft with an alteration fired at a heavy tank in Stadium. You had to guess how many shots it would take to destroy the enemy. The correct answer is 23. Here are our winners, and here's the new question. 